Planet Healthcare is primarily looking for computer science and computer science and engineering, but we're not totally closing the door off to other majors. There's business analysts and systems analysts, so there's a little bit of difference there, but the analyst positions are looking for analytical thinking minds, intellectual people, just able to do analysis and do their job. We have BlackBerry and currently we are looking for software developers. So BlackBerry Business recently just announced that we're coming out with new phones, which will be actually available in mid-March. The students that we are looking for right now is to build our application on the phones and we're just trying to add more engineers into that department. CA Technologies is a very large uh, IT software company and we're looking for software engineers who are going to develop and maintain our software products that we sell and it's really a, a great company you know, to have a job with. Uh, our software spans from security software, mainframe database software. For example, if you use your ATM card today, you're more than likely going to be touching one of our databases or one of our security products that's going to make sure you're the right person that's running that transaction. engineers, project managers around a technical project. Okay, I would say for a student that's interested in coming to IBM, uh, they should have a lot of energy, they should have a lot of passion in what they want to do, be good problem solvers, uh, don't stick to just your own discipline. Really, you've got to think about the, the needs of the business and, and contributing in every way you can. that I was most impressed with was uh, Woodcraft because they got to work a lot with the actual components that go into the gen engine. So not necessarily just analyzing the data, but actually being able to work and design the pieces that go into it. So that was probably my favorite booth so far. Companies like uh, Woodcraft Aircraft, there was Consolidated, DRS Consolidated Controls, Sada. I'm a mechanical engineer, so I have the one of the most diverse branches of engineering I can look into. And the fact that there's so many different companies that I can look at, I feel like I can get a different perspective of what other majors would work with. So some Sada might have more electrical. If I could get an internship with Sada, I'd know how electrical engineers think. So working with a diverse group of engineers does appeal to me. Uh, I think the best part of this career fair was the variety. We're going into a more diversified workplace, and I think that's really good. You know, keeping a good diversity of uh, ideas flowing. 
even though I'm looking for mechanical engineering um, design internships, what I want to do in the future is design prosthetics. So I think that's really helpful for them to be able to do mechanical and biomedical so I can get that design experience at maybe other companies and then go into prosthetics. It's just a really good way to reach out to companies, start networking, and get contact information from as many companies as possible. It's definitely difficult to find an internship. Freshmen is a just good experience. Sophomores can get that internship that they're looking for as well as juniors. Seniors can find really good job opportunities in there and just really good practice in general even if you have something on the side that you already want. Keep your mind open. If you're a high school student, I would suggest looking at different types of engineering while you're in high school, seeing if this is really for you because it's a lot of hard work. Put as much time and effort into it as possible, get very involved, definitely just stick with it. Going into engineering, just like going into anything else that you want to do, you have to make sure that you're passionate about it. And if you're not passionate about it, it's not going to be worth it.